Hi, I'm Patrick Novotny, this is my YouTube channel, and I'm doing how-to videos on every single necktie knot known to man, and I'm bringing them to you. So if that's what you like, then please subscribe. Today I'm going to be doing the fusion knot. The fusion knot's been created by Mr. Linwood. Uh, he is the originator, he is the creator, he is the mastermind behind the fusion knot. Now, it appears to look like a trinity knot with sort of a cape knot sort of tucked in around it or harnessing that knot. Anyways. It looks really cool, and uh, I'm going to take you step by step through that. All right, so here we are, the fusion knot. It's going to be tied with the little end, so it's going to be extra long. We want the big end to be basically uh, pretty close to where you're going to be finished with after you adjust it. Uh, it's not going to need a lot of adjusting room, so I have it a little bit past my belly button. All right, let's have a close look. All right, taking the big end. Got to pinch it, got to have our dimple. From there, we're going to cross over with the little end over the big end and up through the back of the tie, up through the top, and cross over. Should look like that. From here, we're going to take the little end around the back. You're going to see the seam side come up. Now, don't get carried away. We're going to keep this a little bit loose and we're going to take the little guy and feed it up and through the top of the knot coming up the back and crossing over again. Okay, this guy can be a little bit tight. And we want to lo loosen up that first knot or first loop that we did at the beginning. Now, Linwood does this in a lot of his uh, necktie knots and I'm going to be calling this the Linwood U-turn right here. This is the move that he does quite often. He'll come back down and through and then feed it through one of these loops and uh, this is how he's creating many of his neckties and thank you very much for doing so because these are awesome neckties anyhow so we feed the little end through there make sure it's not all folded up creased up jammed up and it's going to go across now from here I want to tighten this up a tiny bit so it's nice and neat as I'm finishing my knot there we go there we go, that looks reasonably tidy for right now. Now taking the little end, we're going to feed it up and through the top of the neck necktie and across again. And this is where we're finishing off with sort of an Atlantic knot or a cape knot style. And then taking the little end in behind the back, keeping a little bit loose because we're going to be tucking the little end down and through this loop right there. All right, now feeding the little end up and down through the top of the necktie. We've got this part still loose. We didn't tighten that up. That's where we're going to feed that the very end through and we're going to slowly tighten that up. So it should look like it should look like a trinity knot harnessed by the cape knot. There we go. That's tight enough. We're going to hold on to the knot itself and pull down with the big end to cinch it up to our neck. So that's how you do the fusion knot. It looks like it's a trinity knot harnessed by a cape knot or an Atlantic knot and uh, it really adds a little bit of pizzazz to your necktie knots. Anyhow, my name is Patrick Novotny, this is my YouTube channel, and I'm doing how-to videos on every single necktie knot known to man, and I'm bringing them to you. So if that's what you like, then please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.